All right, trainer John Sadler has a live hope in the Grade 1 Delmar Oaks on Saturday. I'm not going to pronounce it, but can you help us out with that firstly, John? Chope. All right, there we go. Chope. And when did she first come on your radar? She's been here about five weeks. Um, they bought her in an Arcana sale over there in Europe. Um, so I've known about her for like two months. She spent a couple of weeks in, in France getting ready to come over here. And then she came in right in here to Delmar. How's she settled in here? Really settled in beautifully, exceptionally well. She's one that's just got a great mind for it, never taken a misstep here. And what sort of a horse is she? She, she looks on the smaller side? She's medium-sized filly, very handy. They think that she'll do well on the tight turns and the firm grass. Um, so we think she's well suited for American racing. Have you had a chance to look at that win in the German Thousand Guineas at Dusseldorf? I, I've seen the race. She ran a very good race. Um, you know, it's a little hard to interpret all the the German racing, but she's. it looks like to me she's got a lot of quality. How would you describe your confidence levels heading into Saturday's uh, Delmar Oaks? Well, I really like her. She's a lovely filly. You know, how it goes first time out, you know, coming from, from Europe and everything like that. It's a little bit of a little bit of an unknown, but I know we're taking a nice horse over there. Obviously, I can't let you go without a, a quick word on Flightline. Flightline's doing great. He's about Saturday. He'll be two weeks out from the Pacific Classic. We're really looking forward to that. He's doing just super, loves his track. So fingers crossed for two more weeks. Do you have him exactly where you want him to be uh, this time out from the race? Oh, absolutely. We're ahead of schedule, if anything. So I've just got to restrain myself and not do too much. <laughs>